Don't throw anything at our camera. Kodak Black. Don't throw anything at our camera. Yeah. Rush, call the cops, call Just the cops. Just out of jail. That's when, that's when, that, 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 when, that when you wake the Kodak bell up. I be, I, I, I've been hibernating, chilling, bro. He has been chilling in jail since December, but he accepted a plea deal pleading guilty to a technical violation of his probation. The judge sentenced him to time served. And Kodak's been in custody since plantation police reportedly found him passed out in a Bentley with drugs on him. You want to punch me? I ain't standing you want. I ain't standing you Okay, I'm not going to back down from you, Kodak. I'm not going to back down from you. My son about to be born in less than 48 hours. I ain't worried about, I ain't worried about y'all, man. After throwing rocks at our photographer, and look at that again. I wanted to get your side and say hello to you, and you threatened to and punch me. I did. Threatening to punch me. Don't threaten to punch me again. You understand what I'm saying? You know what I mean? You understand what I'm saying? You want me to call the cops on you right now, Kodak? You know what I mean? You want to threaten to, you want to, threaten to punch me again on the camera? This how I'm living, how I'm living, how I'm living. It ain't nothing like you seen on BET. Kodak sings his Yo. way out of jail. All right, all right. Just like that, he's gone. But the damage is done. It's Bryce Davis on the check-in, and we got Kodak Black acting a goddamn fool with the news camera crew when he got released from jail. In case y'all don't know, he's been in jail since December because he was illegally parked, and you know, police came in and you know thought he had drugs on him because I guess he may have been passed out. I'm not quite sure. You know, originally they said that he had cocaine on him, but come to find out it was nothing but Percocets. Upon his release, I guess he ain't like the news people coming up on him while he was getting out of jail, so he decided to act a fool and just start throwing rocks. Don't throw anything at our camera, Kodak Black. <laughs> and it's obvious that if uh, Don't Give a Fuck was a person, his name would be Kodak Black, because Kodak didn't give a single fuck about the news people outside. And you know, a lot of people on the internet, especially when Drink Chance came out, they thought that Kodak was coked up or he was gone off drugs. And I'm gonna go off of a limb and say, I actually don't believe that no more. I actually believe that this is just Kodak Black. Like, think about it. Like, I'm mind you, I know people get high in jail and stuff like that, but let's say that he was in PC, even though I think that's prison. And let's just say that he didn't have the options of getting anything in jail. If he came out of this, acting like this and we know that he hasn't had any drugs within the last 24 hours then this is just kodak black at his raw it's like this is just him and i don't like how dudes start acting like a male karen at the end don't threaten to punch me again you understand what i'm saying you know what i mean you understand what i'm saying you want me to call the cops on you right now kodak I'm talking about oh uh you want me to call the police don't throw rocks at me like you know you're trying to antagonize that man hoping to get another story up out of it yeah i don't respect that but you know it is what it is but anyway let me know how y'all feel about it in the comments y'all think y'all still believe that about kodak let me know and of course if you like the video make sure you like and subscribe